What's up guys, Lucas here from Sports Advantage and today I'm going to be going with a hex bar deadlift variation with you guys. Unlike the sumo deadlift or the conventional deadlift, this weight puts you in a little bit of a better position in terms of um, center of gravity. The weight is a little bit more centralized as we're going through. Now just because the weight is a little bit more centralized does not mean that this lift is safer. It still involves the same amount of coaching and technique that any other lift involves. We gotta make sure that we're keeping our scaps down and back, our lats tight, we're keeping our spine rigid, and we're not bending through our thoracic spine or our lower back as we're going through. So the first thing I'll show you here is how to uh, do the lift. So our feet are shoulder width apart here when we go down to grab the bar. We wanna bend over at the waist and make sure that we're spreading the floor the entire time. So I'm keeping my glutes active and my knees out. So as I bend down, I wanna set my scaps in a good position, grab the bar here, and as I lift, I wanna push my hips forward, and on the way back down, I will reverse it. Now a good cue to use as we're going through here is to tell the athlete to pull himself through the floor. Sometimes that allows them to not focus so much as lifting with their back as the lifting with their legs. Um, another thing to note is that just like any other core lift that I showed you, uh, bench variations, squat variations, and other deadlift variations, you can add accommodated resistance to this as well. So you can add chains to it and you can add bands to it just to change up the stimulus a little bit. You can also change the range of motion by putting plates underneath of it um, and you can use it as a max effort method and a dynamic effort method. Uh, we use this method with not only our younger athletes, but our older athletes as well to always change up the stimulus and stay on top of their body so that they never adapt to the variation that we're using. Um, if you guys have any questions about the hex bar deadlift or if there's, if there's any other variation of a squat, bench, or deadlift that you would like to see, please shoot us a message and we'll be happy to help you out. Thanks for watching.